channel today i have a kilo fresh and trendy styles uh, hd lace front wig um the style is hd hayden h h a y d e n just so y'all know um the color is gff sunset um this is a ear-to-ear -ear lace front wig this is, has this wig has a center part which y'all can see that's pretty accurate um this is a hd lace front as i already said um this the wig is safe to curl up into 400 degrees fahrenheit um, so yeah, this wig is available in 11B24 Blaze Blush Blonde. Instead of blonde, it says brown. I don't know what that is. Probably like a black and a blonde. I don't know. Uh, GFF Golden, GFF Sunset. So yeah, so I really like the color series. Like they have a lot of different colors in this unit, y'all. So um, as y'all can see, this is the stock card and the back of them, and then all the different colors that they have that are available. It's pretty simple. Like it doesn't really say anything else with the. It's the uh, Kilo unit. So, um, I don't know if it's Kylo Kilo, I, I'm not sure if I pronounced the brand. Um, so yeah, so let's get into a little bit of weird talk about this. So, this unit is definitely gonna be a bit care friendly. They definitely did a good job pre plucking, as y'all can see. Um, they didn't, they, uh, they provided baby hairs, but they didn't give you a lot on the edges. So, if you want to go in and add more, it's completely optional up to you. It's definitely gonna be a big care friendly unit. This wig did come with clips, they're kind of placed weird. So, there's one on the left right here, and then there's one on the right right here. So I don't know how you would probably do it if you can put it down. I don't know how that would work. I know there's one wide one in the back that I attached. Um, I don't know how long she is, y'all. I think she's probably 26, 26 to 28 inches. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say about her. She's definitely HD lace front. I like how they provide the baby as y'all can see. I went ahead and swooped those a little bit. Um, so let's talk about this wig. So it's really, really soft, but really, really frizzy. Um, I'm gonna probably show y'all one side uh, combed out and one side that's not combed out. So I would say if you were to get this unit, just keep some type of spray, like some type of spritz or something that can hold the crimps because they're they're slowly falling, slowly but surely falling. I really like how soft the unit is though. I really love the color scheme that they have going on. That's pretty much all I have to say. Um, I feel like the tracks could have been a little bit laid a little bit differently because right here, uh, I don't know if y'all probably gonna be able to see it, but I feel like. The hair full, but I feel like the tracks aren't as like, as, what is it? The word I'm looking for. The hair's full, but the tracks aren't laid properly. So it's making your hair feel a little bit loose for some reason. Like it's secured on my head and I know it is because of the clips, but it's just um, the way that they laid the tracks. I don't feel like that's anything that, you know, comes, falls on your end. Something that you have to really worry about as long as you're making sure that if you want to wear this, it'll probably be like a simple type of unit. Um, so yeah. I didn't even do anything to like the crimps. Like I said, they're already falling, so I just need to make sure that y'all be aware of that. Like if you're gonna if you're gonna get this unit, I'd probably say just um, braid it. Like even after every time that you wear it, like or if you want to keep it how it is, just braid it so it can keep its uh, crimp uh, texture. So yeah, I'm gonna show the back because that's not too much to really much say about Hater. So this is so this is Hater. Comb it out a little bit. I'm gonna comb out this side just a little, a little bit big but i feel like it's a, a cute big like it ain't too crazy this is the side not combed out i really i don't know i really honestly i think i like the side combed out more that's just my opinion because i feel like these are gonna fall you know like they're gonna they're, this ain't gonna always look like this if you don't got like no type of spray or spritz so it might end up looking like the right side so yeah it's really soft though y'all like this really feels like human hair like for real so yeah, that's not too much to pretty much say about it. I think it's definitely like 28 to 30 inches probably. At first I said 26, but now that you comb, now that I'm combing it out, I feel like it's getting a little bit longer too. Cause you know, like when your when the hair's curled, you don't know the real potential. So, and this has this wig has a lot of flyaways. So make sure that you get you some mousse, probably get some some edge tamer, something to keep 
I, I can say that I like how flat it was though. It wasn't like a humpy, you know, it's, I like how it's flat and you know, pretty simple. So this is both aspects of the wig. Like I said, this is a big hair friendly unit, a really nice uh, flow of hair. Definitely gonna get tangly though. So just be aware of that, like for real. So yeah, there's not too much to say about hating y'all. I don't really have nothing like negative to really say about it. It's, it's, as far as the uh, lace goes, it's a nice lace. It's pre-plucked for sure. They give you more baby hairs than more than I even put down. So if you want to cut those, play around with those, that'll just be completely up to you. So yeah, if y'all like this wig, make sure you keep your brush, okay? Cause it's gonna get tangled. Um, if y'all like this young, y'all know exactly where to be listed and posted. Thank y'all so much for tuning in to Every Mind's YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and give us a subscribe. Um, I'm Aaliyah here and thank y'all so much. Bye.